Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Bonita and I do all types of videos, but today we have a fun tag video. It's the luxury, um, what, what's your name, luxury video? I'll leave the title here, but it's an original video that was started by Mel in Melbourne. It's been probably maybe a year, but I know I saw it floating around right before quarantine, right before Corona hit and everything, and people were doing, they would take luxury items in their collection and they will explain them as it relates to their name or their channel name. I'm gonna do my name, Bonita. All right, so my first bag that I'm going to do with the letter B for Bonita is going to be my Brahmin bag. And Brahmin does not get enough respect in the luxury community. I guess it would be considered a high street bag, but I just love this bag. I okay, um, take it as a handheld tote. You can fit so much stuff in here. I do not take it as much as I should because it's black with the gold hardware. And I prefer black with silver hardware, but nonetheless, it is a beautiful bag. And it's going to be my first bag for B for Benita. It's my Brahmin bag. All right, so my next bag is going to be O. Didn't have anything in particular to start it with the letter O, so I had to get creative. So I took it to me, my oldest bag in my collection. And you guys have seen this bag plenty of times, but it is my Louis Vuitton Speedy bag, um, Speedy 35. This bag now is about 27 years old. I got the Vachetta um, replaced about a year ago. Love the bag, but my oldest bag for letter O in my name is going to be my Speedy 35. All right, so if we're talking about my oldest bag, then you know the next should be my what? Newest bag, right? So my newest bag is my Chanel bag. I recently did a video on that bag as well. And here she is. So my um, newest bag for N in my name would be my Chanel denim flat bag. Love the bag. I haven't taken her in about a couple of weeks. And guess what, y'all? I missed the bag. So I know in my video, it seemed as if, you know, I wasn't a fan, but I am. She has grown on me. Miss her. So that would be my, my newest bag. Okay. All right. So B-O-N and then I. Didn't have a bag, I started with an I, so I said I could mean iconic. So I have a luxury item in my collection that is truly iconic, none other than Chanel number no. 5. This I looked up, I googled like iconic perfumes or fragrances, and this was the number one. And I'm sure they were talking about the original scent, but I have the Chanel number no. 5, if you can see it low. And so I would consider this still an iconic fragrance. You can um, find many reviews and people talking about how much they prefer this over the original scent. It is lighter. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. <laughs> it, is, it is a lighter scent. I do prefer this. My husband loves this. He doesn't like the original scent. I like the original scent. It's just heavier, but this is lighter. And he prefers this, so this is the one that I wear because I want to smell good. Not only for myself, but for him. So um, Chanel number no. five would be for I iconic fragrance in my luxury collection. All right, so the next letter in my name is T. So we have B-O-N-I-T. And that's going to be my Louis Vuitton Kareem. I'm taking this bag now. This is my bag of the week. Um, I usually try to take, you know, my bag for one to two weeks. But whenever I switch into this bag, it's usually about a month because I love this bag. It's full of my junk right now. Impromptu, what's in my bag? It fits a lot. I have my pochette hanging off of it. Um, my mini, um, I'm sorry, my key clay hanging off of it. And just a little um, bonbon there. Poof ball. But um, the Louis Vuitton Terrain, I think I did a video on this bag too. <laughs> I'll link it down below. Love this bag. If you don't have it, you should look into it. If they still, I think they were talking about discontinuing it, so I'm not sure if it's still available, but I'm sure you can find it on the pre-love market. So for T is my Louis Vuitton terrain. All right, so the last letter in my name is A. Again, how to get creative. I don't have anything in my collection that I could think of. Oh, before I move on, also to another T is my truth. Ooh, my truth. I had this laying out on my dresser, so I said I would include this too. I just have a little acrylic um, chain on it. You can use it as a handheld bag. Um, 
but I just keep just my bits and bits and bobs in here. I use it as a cosmetic bag. I use it as some of everything. Love this. So we can have that as a letter T as well. But again, okay, back on track, Benita. My last letter is A. Didn't have anything in particular. Let's start with the letter A, but had your creative. So I said A could mean all all weather leather bag. And this is this. You can take a dummy A bean bag in any kind of weather. And this is my dummy A bean graceful MM. So this would be for the letter A all weather bag. Um, you have the leather straps. Um, you have just the dummy A bean canvas. It's stuff right now because I'm not using it. But you can take this in snow, rain, hot weather, cold weather, whatever. So I consider this an all weather bag because I have taken it in the rain. Rain just rolls right off of it. So it would be my number one bag to take in any kind of weather. So that's why I said a letter A, all weather, leather bag. And again, it's my Louis Vuitton. All right, guys, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this What's Your Name tag um, video. Um, if you like these types of videos, please stick around. Just please like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.